Alright guys, it's that time again for Legos Island Summer. Yes guys, it's finally June again, meaning it's time for Legos Island Summer for the second time. And this time, I promise you, it is so much better than what I had last year. Because one, over the past year, after last year's ending, many rooms were added throughout the island. And now that it's June here, I've now decorated all the other rooms that were never there last year in this year's Legos Island Summer. Now, before we actually get started, I need to go redirect that playlist and um, delete the part that says coming soon in the playlist. So yeah, give me one sec. Done! Alright, now let's get into it. Alright guys, so of course I have obviously accessed Legos Island today to obviously set up Legos Island Summer for this year. So with that being said, last time I accessed it was 3.23 p.m. And the current time is... 6.59 p.m. And yeah, I know that you couldn't see the time yesterday um, when I had my face cam on. I actually thought that I could show you guys that, but turns out I watched the video back and sadly it was incorrect. Oh well. Hey. At least we're here. Legos Out in Summer is here, guys. I've waited so long for this. Guys, let me just tell you right now. Guys, you guys have absolutely no idea how long I've been waiting to do this again. No, seriously, guys. You have absolutely no idea how long I have waited to do this again. I am so excited right now. I'm so happy that I'm doing this again for you guys. I loved doing Legos Island Summer last year, and now that it's back again, thanks to me bringing it back, which I am so glad that I decided to bring it back because I loved it last year, um, we're here doing it again. Woo! Now, it's the same dates as last year, so nothing's different. Although all the rooms are different, though, Yep, all the rooms are completely different, and no room has been reused from last year. Every single room this year is completely new and was never seen last year. I will literally prove that to you right now. I'm not joking, guys. Every single room in this entire Lego Island Summer this year is not reused from last year. Every room is completely different this year. So, yeah. Also, what a coincidence, last year, another known fact, we didn't even have the music on, because I didn't decide to turn the feature back on yet until February of this year. So that's a difference, you can finally hear the music again in these videos now. So guys, um, this is actually where I spawned in last year for when I actually did the video. Hold on, let me actually just completely change that today. There we go. Alright, so as we can see, um, the balcony is obviously a different um, shade of wood. Um, the, the color is different, and that's because I obviously decided to change it. Unlike last year where it was jungle wood. I mean, that was a good summer theme, and I loved it. I, again, just wanted to change everything up. And you'll see what I mean in just a second. Alright, first things first, let's head into my cave. Well, actually, first, before that, as you can see, the palm trees are in the exact same spots up here from last year. I mean, all the palm trees down there, those are in completely different spots. But let's go to my cave first. Alright, guys, so as you can see, of course, because it's been updated for night vision, the cave looks a lot darker now than previous. And, yeah. First off, you might notice, the pool is not here from last year, and I'll show you guys where I actually put that this year, because I actually put it somewhere really cool. Anyway, aside from that though, let's actually just get on with this. So, yep, this is where the cave is, um, 
Now note that the um, item huts in this room are the are in the exact same spots from last year. So for example, June 1st is right here. That's from last year. June 2nd was here last year and is again. And June 3rd is also right here in the exact same spot from last year. Also, like last year as well, um, the lounge chairs are in the same spots. Although, I don't think these were because this is where the pool was. So, these two were not here last year. Another difference in this room, I mean, the lounge chairs and the item huts, um, those are the only things that are the same from last year. I mean, the item huts are a little different because of the sand, but they're technically in the same spots. Another difference with this room is right here. Last year, it was jungle wood and uh, jungle leaves. But actually, are these jungle leaves? Yep, jungle leaves. <laughs> I just wanted to know. Uh, so yeah, as you can see, this is melon and a sponge. You might wonder why did I pick those? Well, I love being random, and those just looked really good for summer. So I chose these um, for this. Because it looked cool. Of course, the sand on the floor is obviously from last year, of course. Again, there's the item booth for June 1st. I'll get into that later after I explore the rooms. Also, let me clear that really quick. There we go. Up here, uh, my bed last year <coughs> was um, jungle wood and jungle leaves. But this time, it's a melon and sponge. Now, also, the ladder also had to be, like, a little bit, like, positioned on the wall a little, because the jungle leaves wouldn't allow a ladder to be sticked onto them. So, yeah. But, um, that's kind of different. And also, this is not, uh, the, um, jungle fence. Actually, is that what it's called? Uh. I forgot what it's called. Yep, the jungle fence. Just wanted to know. But yep, that's also completely different. Um, maybe I should, um, guys, should I place some more lights in here? I probably should place more lights in here. Because this room's really dark. And yeah. Anyway, I hope you guys love the cave. I, as you can again see, it looks pretty much like completely different compared to last year. And I just love it that way. So yeah, guys, that's pretty much all for the cave. There's nothing down in the event room, so that's why I'm not going down there, because there's literally zero things updated down there. Although I am going to start doing uh, free item room 4. I'll be doing that soon in the next few days. But yeah, back up to the little balcony. We got day 4 and day 5. These are actually in the same spots from last year. And actually, some of the beginning ones are actually in the same spots. Funny enough, I just wanted to just keep in mind, all the June um, item slots, um, all the June item huts are actually in the same spots from last year. Well, actually, one of them isn't, which is June 6th. But, hope you guys love this. It looks really, really, really cool. Alright guys, let's move on to the next part of the rooms. You may have noticed that you actually saw a small glimpse of this down here, but this is what it looks like this year. Look, as you can see, it looks completely different compared to what you saw last year. And man, that is a lot of palm trees. That's probably actually more than last year. But yeah, there's actually a lot of things that you can expect this year. Last year, this was actually all water. Um, but this year, it is an umbrella with two lounge chairs. Because why not? And I also did add a little water, just to get a little feel from last year. Like I said, the June ones are actually in the same spots from last year. And yes, there is the June schedule. I'll get to that in just a second. This says Legos Island Summer 28, no, 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 2019, June 1st to August 31st, so it's going on for the exact same time, for, uh, um, just like last year, it's going on for the exact same time, just like last year, although obviously the only difference is of course the text, because, you know, back then, we weren't even able to even, like, change the text color, it, it was still always black, but that was until 1.14, almost two months ago. 
that we were able to do that. Like I said, let's get into the June 2019 schedule. So this says June 2019 schedule. This says Legos Island Summer 2019, June 1st, August 31st. Three months, 92 items. And then over here, we got this. As you can see, if you look here, uh, this is actually... Actually, this is actually a part of one of the item booths in this party. So it says, like last year, two items will be given out at the June 27th item booth in celebration of turning 17. So, yep. We did that last year for when I turned 16. And we're going to do it again for when I turn 17. Um, later on when that actually is true. But... <sighs> Who cares about that now, because that's like a long time from now. Anyway, just wanted to pull that up for the June schedule right there, because of course I always have to show that, because I always have to show the June schedule. I have to show every month's schedule, because otherwise you wouldn't know what's coming to the island if I didn't never show you guys the schedule. And it's only been a thing since April, funny enough. But yep, that's the June 2019 schedule. Alright guys, moving on, we have... Uh, we have in here, like I said, the subways are actually different. Like I said, pretty much everything is completely different from last year. Let me clear that again. So, yeah. Um, let me show you guys some cool things. As you can see, this says unlocks June 6th. So this is actually in a different spot, because I think last year, I think I had it like right here where the schedule is. I think I had the June 6 item hut right here where the schedule is. So of course because the schedule is here, I had to move June 6 right here. But every other one is still in the exact same spot. Over here, this is where June 7th was last year and is again. So yeah, this is where June 8th is. This is the same spot from last year. June 9th was also in this spot last year too. Alongside June 10th. Hope you guys like this so far. But yeah, all these except for June 6th are the exact same spots from last year. And if I go into any of them, none of them are unlocked because obviously today is only day one out of 92. Yes, guys, you heard me. 92 days. That's how long last year's was and will be again. So yet you're going to have to get used to the design for three months again. Well, technically, this is a new design that was never here last year. And I'll head down there in just a minute. Obviously, I want to head up to the mountain first like we did last year. Uh, before we actually do, uh, as you can see, there's many palm trees around here. But yep, yeah, the palm trees are really, really cool. And I love it all. See so, yeah. up. Uh, we'll head down to the underground party room in just like a few seconds. Oh, actually, I forgot to change that back. Actually, why didn't I change it into this? That's what it should have been all along. Once more, these are also in the same spots from last year. Yep, same spots from last year. Along with that. And that. Although that's messed up. And this. All of those are in the same spots from last year. How crazy is that? All of this is in the same spots from last year's summer event. And 
And this is what I was talking about right here, June 27. But anyway, like I said, all of these are in the same spots from last year. At least the June ones are. Look, you might recognize June 19th, June 20th, June 21st, June 22nd, June 23rd. Yes, as you can see, all of these are in the same spots from last year. The only difference is the um, sand instead of jungle wood. And of course the text on the signs. Also, the subway is again different as well. Because last year it was jungle leaves instead of sand. Plus, actually, I should actually take a note, most of everything that used to be jungle wood last year is now sand. Don't you guys love this? I know, it's incredible! Now this is also in the same spot from last year. Now the text is blue because that's for July. The green text is for June. The blue text is for July. And I'll show you guys which text I have for August later. Now, funny enough, um, as you can probably notice, not all the dogs are actually here because like three of them died uh, while I was trying to get them back up here. One of them, like, three of them actually drowned in some of the water that I had in the island. Which, I have no idea why. I mean, like, that's kind of weird. But at least it did. I'll go revive them later. Because right now I'm showing you guys this. Now, funny enough, most of everything here is obviously completely different. Because all of this used to be jungle wood alongside with these as well. Um... And there also used to be some water in this room, but as you can probably see this year, I took that out because, well, first off, this is here leading down there. Now, if you're wondering if I did anything down here, um, let me just um, keep you in warrant. Nothing. And also, why do I even still have these guys down here? I don't even come down here. Like, why do I even still have this room? Oh, and I see that's also still there from, like, two months ago or something. Almost. Because today, June only just started. But, um, next up up here, um, as you can see, this also looks really cool. Yep, there's palm trees up here, which is awesome. Now, of course, since this room did not exist until September last year, this is obviously completely new. Yeah, because that room did not exist until September, the upstairs, alongside the downstairs. So, see, some of this is actually different. Also, there's some palm trees which are in the same spots from last year. I mean, these two here actually were never here. I just put those in for new decoration. But most of this room, as you can see, is not from last year. And you might wonder, why can't I just take any of the dogs? Simple. Because I just don't feel like it right now. And plus, I don't want to have another one, you know, die again. Because it would take years to obviously get these guys back. So, yeah. Maybe another day I will. Maybe during one of the episodes of Lego's Island Sub. But, um, yeah guys, let me also know below, what do you guys think of this amazing design for the, um, mountain this year? What do you guys think? Let me know below in the comments. I love hearing your feedback on this. It really is appreciative. So yeah, that's the design this year, guys. It looks a lot more different compared from last year. As again, most of this was all jungle wood, but now it's sand because I wanted to obviously change it up. See, so yeah, we have June 26, then June 27, which that's cool. But yeah, guys. Uh, I think we're done here on the mountain. So, let's head back down. And, yeah, let's go. Yeah, this is definitely so different from last year, as you can probably already tell. And you'll see the rest of it right now. Yeah. 
There we go. Next up on our journey. Also, this also used to be water last year, too. But I obviously took that out. Now. Next up, we go on to the outside of the lodge. As you can see, the palace is completely different this year. Which it is. Now, like, half of these are actually in the same spots from last year. I'll give you guys which ones are. July 2nd, July 3rd, July 4th, and July 5th. All of those are in the same spots from last year. Yep, all four of these days are in the same spots. The rest are not. They are in completely different spots. But let me just give you guys a little rundown of this. So, without further ado, of course, obviously, all these have nothing in them because they're not unlocked yet. Now, as you can see, this is where the blue text is. Also, in also contribution to last year, I brought this back because it was so cool last year that I decided to bring this back for 4th of July. Yep, the number four on the 4th of July thing. Yep, this is actually the exact same design for the number four I had for last year. This is nothing different, it is all the same. Alongside, in here too. So everything is pretty much the same with that. Yep, July 3rd, nothing because obviously this is not unlocked yet until then. July 5th, nothing because of course there's nothing here yet. Now, let's head inside the lodge, but before we do, oh, uh, hold on, there we go, just had to fix that, um, as you can see here, the outside of the lodge actually looks really cool, what do you guys think of this? Yeah, I want to hear your feedback in the comments, what do you guys actually think of this? Do you guys like it? Let me know below in the comments. I'll explore the rest of this right after we go through, um, the lodge. Now, a little known fact. The lodge was actually never decorated last year because it was too new at the time. Because it only just came out to the island on May 30th. And Lagos Island Summer last year started on June 1st. So it was two days after the lodge was built. So the lodge was too new to be decorated. But now since it's been around for a year, as of two days ago, I now decorated it this year. Like this. And yeah, sorry guys that I am really loud while I'm, when I'm saying this. It's just, I'm too overexcited right now. So yeah, sorry if I am pretty loud. I'm just, I'm just too excited right now that I'm doing this again. Because it's been a year. But yeah, this is what the lodge looks like last, um, this year. This is a completely new design. That was never here from any other year, because again, the lodge was never decorated last year, because last year it was too new for it to be decorated. So yep, that's what I did here. And yes, as you can see, this is actually a pool. Right here. Although, there's actually one in um, one of the other rooms, which I actually forgot to show you guys the underground party room. I'll show you guys that later. But yeah, there's also palm trees here. And there's also lounge chairs here, along with sand. Hope you guys love it! Now up here, there's also something cool. Yeah, not much for a difference up here. The only difference you can see is pretty much the floor, the carpet, and some palm trees. Aside from that else, you cannot see any other difference in this room. If you're wondering if, any, if anything's up here, the answer to that is no. Nothing up here. Uh, in the attic. That's because I didn't want to decorate it. And plus, I, I only just had it decorated for the, uh, lodge first anniversary, just only like a few days ago. Now that we got out of the lodge, I can explore this now. So last year, one of the item huts were actually right here where this palm tree was. But, I wanted to change it up, and did this instead. So as you can see, this is another combined item hut, just like the one on the mountain. Despite only last year having one combined, um, one combining two huts into one. But this year I decided to add a second one. 
So this says July 6th, nothing in there because it's not that day yet. July 7th, nothing in there because it's not that day yet either. But, yep, this is what I did instead. Now, aside from that, there's no other item huts behind there. I mean, last year I think there was, but not this year because I wanted to change it up. And I also could have done something to the theme park um, entrance thing, but I didn't feel like it. Alright guys, next up, we'll head up to the theme park in just a minute. Let's actually go to the resort first, before we go there. Because I actually want to follow where the item huts go. So as you can see up here, this says July 8th. Of course, nothing in there, because it's not July 8th yet. That's in like a month. Then up here, this is July 9th. Uh, so yeah, as you can see, these all are in different spots now. And up here, there's even a palm tree right here. But this says July 10th, which is also really cool. Now, last year, this wasn't even decorated. Now, although there is pretty much nothing in here, actually, the only difference is right here and the floor. Other than that, nothing else is decorated. And I also replaced the lava with water, of course, because it's summer. Oh, and before you even ask me, I know it's not summer everywhere in the world. Some of you already told me that like a year ago. And guys, I still know that it is of course not summer everywhere in the world, but at least it is for me. That's why I'm holding this, because it's summer where I am. Well, on the 21st it will be. Um, on June 21st it will be summer. For me, at least. But I know it's not summer everywhere in the world. Before you guys even ask me that and tell me that, yes, I know it's not summer everywhere in the world. So, yeah, you don't need to tell me that because I already know from a year ago. Like, yeah, I know it's not summer everywhere in the world. I, I know that already. So, yeah, you don't need to tell me again to whoever is going to probably tell me. So, yeah. Um, aside from that, there's also some palm trees right here. And yeah, it's all really, really, really cool. Last year, the path with the lodge was actually jungle wood and jungle leaves. But this year, it is melon and sponge, because that makes a good summer colors right there. Alright, so yeah, we can just uh, get out of here. I hope you guys love this. It definitely took a lot of time and effort to actually do this now, guys. So, let's go ahead and actually head up to the resort. Now, the resort is also really cool and custom. Oh, yes, yeah, so there's also a palm tree right behind there. Right behind the July 10th item booth. Well, the item hut. Because that's kind of what they were for the items last year. Now, here is actually really cool. If you look here... This is somewhat different compared to what you've ever seen before for the resort. Now, I kind of want to ask the known question. Should I actually keep the palm trees permanent after this is over? Because, well, it would fit the resort a lot more. Although this is technically a summer-themed area, the resort can really be used for anything, actually. Even fall, even winter, even spring, but mainly summer. Which is why it looks like this. Of course, it's obviously mainly summer themed for this event. But it also can be used for other summer themed things. As you can see, this is where we move on. July 11th, July 12th, July 13th. All these have nothing in them. And do I hear a dolphin? Yeah! There's one right there. Yay! Is one going to actually come up? Is one going to come up? Is one going to come up? Okay, I guess that guy is probably not going to come out of the water, but honestly, I guess that's okay. But yeah, I hope you guys love this Legos Island Summer Themed, res themed Resort. Took a while to do, because I had to pretty much change everything in this room. Such as adding the palm trees and changing the umbrella colors, which are the colors of the path in the lodge. But yeah, 
Let me know below, guys, what you think of this beautiful summer-themed resort. Next up, guys, let's head on to the beautiful Big Bar! <laughs> okay, let's try that again, shall we? Alright, guys, let's head down to the um, theme park. Hopefully we can actually get that correct this time. I accidentally flew too quickly. But also the path is still here too. Yep, I also changed that too. Welcome to the summer themed theme park. Now despite the theme park coming exactly two weeks after last year's summer event ended, this is the first time the theme park's ever being decorated for summer as it's actually never been here in the summer before as again, it came exactly two weeks after like it's out in summer 2018 ended. So it came exactly two weeks after last year's summer event ended. It opened on September 15, 2018, which was exactly two weeks after the summer event ended for the year. So this is the first time for it being decorated for summer. So I hope you guys love it. It looks really cool. As you can see, I did promise I would rebuild the um, prize bill, although I kind of want to change that for the, um, the color. That's better! And more like it. Also, I can get rid of all of this right here. Um, but yeah, here's where we are now. This is kind of what we're doing here. So yeah. Uh, as you can see here, there's multiple palm trees. And yes, I did out- Whoa, 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 whoa! That's also supposed to be water. Don't know how I forgot about that. There we go. Um, but this is- Like, there's water all over the theme park entrance. And this is also where we continue on with the item huts. This says July 14th. So this is where we continue with the item huts. You know, eventually eventually when we actually get to these in July. But yeah, this is basically what the um, theme park entrance looks like. I hope you guys love it. And nice, I even flew into the theme park. Um, the roller coaster park. Also, as you can see, I did put some bits of sand there. This is July 15th. And there's also some palm trees around here, too. So, yep. I also cleaned up all the puddles from the rainstorm. So, yep. This is what the, uh... Uh... Roller coaster Park looks like for summer, as again, the theme park, again, did not come until after the theme... Uh, until after summer ended, which was this event. Of course, the roller coaster has never existed in the summer before, alongside the park itself, the whole park itself. You know, this entire theme park again. In here, let's switch it back to daytime. Here's what the game park looks like for summer. And of course, as you can see, I have ch I have fixed everything that was damaged in the rainstorm. So yes, as you can also see, the target's also been fixed over there. We'll get to there in just a second. But this is July 16th, so yep, yep, this is literally what it looks like for summer, and I really, really, really hope you guys love it, it's really cool, and I love every bit of this room, I hope you guys love it too, and yes, I love this music, it's like all my favorite music is coming on today, probably just fighting this event going on. Or maybe it just feels like it. Alright guys, here we are in the Pirate and Bullseye Park. This is the last part for the theme park here. As you can see, there are multiple palm trees scattering around the, um, the Bummer Belt game. And I love every bit of it because it makes it just so much more summer themed. And yes, the water park is decorated. I'll get to that in just a second. So yeah. I'll get to that in just a second. But this is July 17th. So yeah, there's palm trees all over, as you can see. And I love every bit of it. So, yep. Yeah. Again, like I said, the target has been fixed. 
because the evil shit leader is, you know, disappeared from the island again and is now headed back to the lab to um, destroy the rest of the lab during the final five days of Lab of Doom at the lab. Yes, in case you're wondering, yes, Lab Doom is still going on in Zoya's Lab 2 and Zoya's Lab 3. I'll head over there in the next few days before it ends. Next up, let's head on to the water park. Let me just get one more view of this really quick. So yep, this is all what it looks like. I hope you guys love this. Only decorations here in the water park include of the item booths, nothing else. So this says unlock July 18th. Next up, we head down here. This is July 19th and July 20th. So yep, yeah, those are the only decorations in the water park. There is literally Nothing else that I decorated here in the water park because that's all I felt like adding. And yeah, that's literally it for the water park. That is probably the shortest room I ever had to tour. Wow. Alright guys, next up, as you can see, we're on the other side of the island. First off, before we show you guys the item booths, there are palm trees around. So yeah! Seriously guys, I'm so happy that this is back. This is July 21st right here. And July 22nd. Now, as you can see, these are both in the same spots from Legos Island Christmas last year. So yep, yeah, this is in the exact same spot from Legos Island Christmas last year for December 20th last year. And this is the spot where the 18th door was for the advent calendar in December last year. So yeah, both of these are in the same spots that those two advent calendar doors were in December. Oh yeah, remember, who can forget about the palm trees? That's the one awesome difference about this room. Again, I again do apologize that I am pretty loud. It's just, guys, again, I'm too happy that this is back. I just can't get over that this is back. I cannot get over that Lake Island Summer is finally here again. I'm just too overhyped and excited. That's why I'm so loud. I'm just too overexcited for this, guys. That's why I'm so loud right now, because I'm just too overexcited to do this again. I just cannot believe it's here again. I love it all. So yeah, that's again why I'm loud, because I'm just too overhyped to see that this is back again. Because I loved doing this last year. This It was so much fun last year, and I'm so glad I brought it back again. See, so yeah, again, that's why I'm loud. And I promise in my next video I won't be, which is actually Saturday Stores. And then after that, that's literally it for the day. And I know I, I will get back to Creator Us very soon. I just got, the only thing I gotta do left is just install it on this laptop. Then we should be good to go. 
Yep, all I have to do is just install Creativeverse on this laptop, and we should be good to go and go back to Creativeverse. That's all I gotta do, just install the game on this laptop. But yep, palm trees all over. Like I just said, I hope you guys love it. It's really awesome and custom, as the other side of the island actually never existed last year um, in Legos Island Summer. Again, most of these rooms that you're seeing actually never existed last year in Legos Island Summer. Alright guys, next up on our list for our tour is the beautiful campsite. And yes, I actually put the words back. So as you can see, this goes down a little and then it goes back to the normal path. Let's ring this. I just love ringing the bell. And yes, there's more item boost over there, but that's not really the case. Next up, we got July 23rd, which is going to be really cool. And that's the only one down here, aside from that one over there, leading into the wilderness. But that is actually another one from, like, a few days after. Yeah, I wonder where this came from. Who knows why that's there, because I didn't place it. Alright guys, next up, we got July 24th, right here. Yep, that's July 24th. Next up, here in the campsite, there's not really anything for a difference other than the item booths. Yep, the item booths are the only differences in these rooms right here. Oh, and in case you're curious, guys, I actually did not put anything in the dog park. Just wanted to let you guys know. And to prove to you, I actually didn't do anything in the dog park. Let me go down there. See, look! Nothing different. Yep, there is nothing different um, in the dog park. That's because I forgot to add stuff. But honestly, who cares? Who cares? Let's head back to the campsite now. This says unlocked July 25th, three years on YouTube, because that day is when this channel all be gone. Yep, July 25th, 2016 is when this channel be gone, and that's almost four... No, 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 that's almost three years ago. Heck, that's actually next month! Next up is July 26th. Then July 27th. July 28th. Which is actually the one year of these Saturday stories. I couldn't fit Saturday because it wouldn't fit in stories if I put that in. So I just had to put one year of stories. But yeah, that's July 28th. And finally, July 29th. And that's it for the campsite. Nothing else is new here. Next up, you may have wondered why there were some more item booths over there. Heading into the wilderness, it's actually kind of obvious. As you can see, this says July 30th. And July 31st. Now, we head into August. To, uh, the August item moves. As you can see, uh, hold on. This says unlock, um, uh, unlocks August 1st, and this is now in yellow text. So, June is green, July is blue, and yellow is August. So, yeah, those are the free colors for text on each of these item booths for each month. Hope you guys love the colors I picked. But, yep, these are for August. The yellow ones are the August ones. So, yep. Alright, we're now moving into the August ones. So, as you can see, I did put them in the wilderness. Yep, there's August 2nd. August 3rd. August 4th. 5th. 6th. 7th. Actually, let's go down the actual respective hall. There we go. The 8th. August 9th. Yeah, what the heck, now let's just go through this. Then August 
August 10th. Oh no! <laughs> Let's actually just try the challenge while we look for the item booths. Yeah. Oh no! 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 There we go, August 11th. Then August 12th. Oh yeah, that also should be gone too. Because that's almost from two months ago. Can you guys believe how much more I extended this event? There are so many more rooms I've now extended this in. August 13th. August 14th. And finally, August 15th. So guys, that's all the ones for the wilderness. Let's get out of here. And now there is only one place left in this entire event that is definitely worth the showcasing. And is where the rest of the item booths are. Let's go to that place. Which is none other than, you probably can see it down there, the village. Anyway, first before we actually showcase the village, here is the um, subway here. Yep, last year it was in jungle wood for the, instead of sand. So, as you can see here, this is a more custom-made version from last year's. This is a more custom version of last year's. And I honestly could never have been more proud of it. So, yeah. Anyway, yep, this is the village. Yep, this is a more custom version of last year's. So, yeah. Actually, a known fact about every single item hut in this village... Funny enough, they're all in the same spots from last year, including the ones up there on the roof. And yes, as you can see, I have managed to change all the windows back. So yep, yeah, this is the village now. Again, more custom version of last year's. I mean, technically, it's pretty much completely different, but it's a more custom-made version of last year's. Also, another awesome fun fact is that the palm trees are also in the same spots as last year, too, for the village. If we head inside, all the inside rooms are completely different from last year. And I honestly could never have been more pleased. Last year, there was water surrounding this room. But as you can see, I took it out. Oh, right. This guy is no longer active thanks to the village and pillage update. Which I still love. Which, actually, that was kind of one of the mobs in last night's Evil Sheet Leader war fight, which is which was a pillager. Yep, there were a few pillagers in there. That we had to shoot down during then. Um, but yep, this is the design for the coffee shop. Again, completely different from last year. As all this was pretty much made of jungle wood, but now it's sand. And yeah, this is completely different from last year's. Um, coffee shop design. Next up is the library. Oh no! I forgot to design this room! One sec! That's more like it! Although I don't really see too much of a difference, so maybe I should actually add water. Hold on, let's see how this will look, actually. Take a look at this. Uh-oh. Hold on. Uh -oh. Yeah, maybe that could work. For now. Um, uh, I'm not sure, actually. I really don't know. What are we gonna do? How are we going to make this good? Because I don't know if the room looks that decorated. The room doesn't really look anything different. Oh. 
It literally does not look anything different. Too much. But, I guess that's probably how we're gonna keep it. Maybe for now. Well. Actually, maybe the water thing is actually not a bad idea. Yeah, let's put in that at least. Yeah, that's actually perfect. Okay guys, as you can see, if we head inside the houses, they look a little different. Now of course the bed is actually a little different now. They are this year's colors for the summer. Because this year now it's yellow and light green, where last year it was brown and dark green. It also goes for the same thing in here too. So yeah. Also, instead of jungle wood planks, I put birch planks. Yep, I put those instead of the jungle wood planks. Because those like those fit a lot better. And I don't know why I keep messing up words there, but... Yeah, I don't care. And yes, like I said, all the palm trees you might recognize, they are all pretty much in the same spots from last year's summer event. Seriously, this is a more custom version of last year's, as I have said multiple times. Also, a new coincidence seeing as the clothes shop was actually never here last year because it was built on October 10th, 2018. Let's see how it looks in the summer. Yep, this is how it looks in the summer. Also, if you look, I still don't have the June catalog updated yet. Because I only just finished this. But yeah, it actually looks really cool. And I really love this. And I just love every bit of this, like, clothes shop design. Despite it not even being here last summer because it came during Halloween party last year. Yeah, it came during the Halloween party last year. Also, this is another pool that we have here in um, the summer event. But you want to know where the main pool is for this that I replaced from the cave? Well, you'll see in just a second. Yep, this is kind of what I did here. It all looks really cool. And I just love every bit of this room. I just can knock it over it. It looks awesome. So, yep. Oh, also, this is also what I did on the um, back of it. Yep, that's as you can see. And I also did this on the back of each building, too. So, yep, yeah, this is more custom. And I loved every bit of it. Again, let's showcase a few of these item booths. So, you yeah, have the same spots from last year. Oh yeah, that's also still blown up from like a month ago. Holy frick, it is more darker in here than I thought. Alright guys, as you can see up here looks pretty much the same from last year aside from the item booth difference. Three years of backyard videos on August 25th. Yes, guys, the last day is August 31st. And like last year, the door is locked and it is yellow. And there's only one more room. First up, also, you can see the fountain is different from last year. Last year, it was jungle wood and jungle leaves. But again, it is now a melon and a sponge. But I hope you guys love this year's village for summer. It looks really awesome. And I love every bit of this.
Again, one more room to go. The last ever room is actually where the pool for this year is located. Yep, it's right here. This is where the pool is this year. Yep, the pool is located now here in the underground party room this year. So yep, that's really awesome. And yeah, it looks like pretty much all five of the sheep are here. Except for flower sheep. But yep, this is where the underground pool, um, party room is now. All the other rooms are not decorated because I don't feel like it. Yep, I don't feel like decorating the other rooms. Man, these rooms look so much more darker. And those flower sheep. I'm going to have to bust into these walls until she gets out. There we go. Let's get her into the pool! Let's go! There we go! All of them are in the pool. So, yep. This is where the pool is located this year. And, of course, there are palm trees around here, too. Now, sadly, this chest won't be able to be accessed for three months. Honestly, who cares? We don't even go in there. Like, at all, actually. Well, what if one of the sheep here die? I honestly won't care, because I won't even be down here that much during this event, even though it'll be going on here for three months. Yeah, even though this will all be here for three months. I know, it's absolutely crazy how all this is here. And yet, this is the underground party room this year. Despite the underground party room coming here to the island on February 3rd. Yep, February 3rd. Of this year. So yeah. <laughs> With that being said, guys, that's actually all the rooms in this party. Honestly, doesn't it look a lot better this year than it did from last year? Let me know below if this year's looked better than last year, or do you think... Last year's looked better than this year's. Let me know below in the comments. And the last thing I need to show you guys is day one of the Legos Island Summer 2019. Now, once again, this is back to being a every three day series again, just like we did last year in last year's summer event. Because every three days, um, we did this thing for the series. So let's open it up and claim these two hats. Okay, both of them were actually claimed. But yep, yeah, that was June 1st. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Guys, we didn't get to claim the hats. Oh, well. Hold on. Bear it right back. All right, guys, let's try that again with my inventory actually empty. Okay, we're clear. So we have claimed the Legos Island Summer 2018 hats. And the Lego Island Summer 2019 hat. You might wonder, why is the 2018 one in here? Well, funny enough, guys, this hat was actually supposed to be released last year, but I forgot to release it. Yup, it was actually supposed to be released in a day one's item booth alongside the jukebox, but I actually forgot to add it, and that's why you only saw the jukebox last year. Yup, day one was supposed to actually contain two items. One, this hat, and two, the jukebox. But I forgot to add in this hat because I just, again, forgot to. But let's take a look at the other one, which is the 2019 one. But yeah, this is what the 2018 one looks like. It looks really cool. But now let's try on the 2019 one. you can probably see it looks exactly the same as the anniversary party hat from our second anniversary but that is not um the point here 
It may look exactly like the second anniversary hat, but honestly, it doesn't matter. Alongside the 2018 Legos Island Summer hat, it look exactly the same color as the camp hat. But who cares about that either? Aside from that, those are the two items you can get. All the other items, except for uh, June 27th, will have one item. Because, of course, mainly there's only one item in each of these item booths. Except for June 1st and June 27th. In this year's event, at least. So, guys, that pretty much completely wraps up this year's Legos Island Summer 2019 Day 1 alongside showcasing this event overall. What do you guys think? Let me know below in the comments. And guys, with that being said, um, in the next few days on June 4th, I will showcase Day 2, Day 3, and Day 4. So be on the lookout for that, guys. And wow, what a great time for it to sunset. But yeah, guys, with that being said, what is your favorite room in Legos Island Summer this year? Again, do you think I did a better job than I did last year? Or do you think last year's was better? Let me know below. Aside from that, guys, there's one more video I got for you guys, which is Saturday Stories, which I already got planned 100%. I already got it 100% planned, and I already know what I'm going to do. So with that being said, guys, like the video, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later for Saturday Stories. All right, guys, goodbye. Let me go up to my cave to actually uh, get out of here. Uh, what's actually spawned from, from right here? There we go. Clear. See ya.